Rock, paper, scissors, your answer on two, one, two. Hold them up high. We have some different answers out here. I see twos, threes, and fours. B, C, and D. <clears throat> First of all, let's go back to this original equation. One half times the quantity. I have a feeling we're going to have a few different options here. So let's make a list and then we can discuss it. Give me your answers. Go ahead. Hector, what's the first one? All right. Give me another. Aaron. Trapezoid. Okay. Now, for the four answers we have here, A, B, C, and D, I don't want to start by asking which one you think is right because I want to focus on the explanations that we have. So let me hear what people think of D. I don't care if you think it's right or wrong. I just want to hear what people think for answer D. Three, two, one. We have a lot of disagreement on this one. Riley Ann, you disagree. <coughs> Why do you disagree? So you're not combining like terms? Okay, hold on. Guys, want everybody to stop for a second. Put your hands down, put your pencils down. I'm seeing so much of a common mistake that we need to address it. I'm waiting for tracks and slants and pencils down. I'm actually really glad I saw what I saw. Kelly, you gotta sit up. This is gonna help me to help you. I know the area of the pizza, I know the area of the box, but I don't know the area of the unshaded part. How do I find that? Two red hands. Three brave hands, four brave hands. How do I find that, Jesus? Now, one thing I noticed in Diane's work was something that appeared in, in a couple other Prepsters' answers. And Ramel has been so gracious as to offer to let us revise his answer to make it even stronger. Because this is something that I saw a couple of us do. So give him two claps. On two, one, two. <laughs> Build that confidence. And I want you to give me your best response to the claim on the very last page. You are responding to the statement, a slave's life was somewhat difficult. Is that an accurate statement? Is it false? Explain using evidence from the document. I dare you to use evidence from all three. 